One of the main reasons for doing STEM that we believe is, is ultimately to make children more employable. It gives them the opportunity to see why they learn science, the relevance of science. It makes them more willing to learn their science, their technology and their maths to see how they link together. And by taking them out to various competitions, it enables them to interact with various professionals and just to see what science is like in the real world. STEM is great fun for me because it's something that we wouldn't usually do in lessons, so it opens our eyes to different opportunities that we could take in the future. They really, uh, the activities after school are really good because they like, make you enjoy it more. Some of the projects that we've got going on in this school, we've got children looking at wind turbine efficiency, we've got children looking at pond biodiversity, we've got children investigating nutritional content of snack bars, we've got other children trying to produce um, a chewing gum remover, which we're very interested in in the school actually, um, and just a whole range of different projects. So because obviously me being a girl, I find makeup quite interesting. So being able to relate to that with science was quite fascinating for me. So we were distilling oils off um, different groups of fruit peelings to create uh, a purer smell that would go into our cosmetics. They put the choppings or the petals into a test tube and put a cork on top of it and then with a Bunsen burner we heated some water. We get the essences out by condensing the steam. We hope to achieve the perfect pond that any creature can live in, like frogs or fish. I'm testing different ponds to see what their pH is and I'm testing the temperature as well. Science isn't boring, I think it's really fun. Our project was trying to study um, wind turbines and how efficient they were and if the blades really did make a big difference or whether it was just the shape or the angle or something like that. To make the wind we used a big fan which was um, really powerful and almost a backward tuva. Uh, to make sure it was accurate each time we used um, a, a meter ruler to make sure that the distance away from it was equal each time to make it a fair test. Okay, one of the reasons for taking part in the Big Bang was to give the children a chance to show off what they've learned. To give them the opportunity to show their parents and other teachers and other schools exactly what they're capable of. The cool thing that we got was um, we went into a competition for the Hinkley area and we um, won that competition at a local college and um, then we went on to the Midlands one and we also won the bronze for that. So this next year in March, we're going to London, which is quite exciting. Word gets around the school of what kind of experiments is happening. So they want to attend it themselves and observe what's really happening. Since last year, when we had children winning through from the regional finals, the numbers of people wanting to attend the clubs this year has just gone through the roof and we're almost at the point of having to turn people away. Children should definitely come to STEM and Crest. It boosts your confidence in science loads. And when we went to the Big Bang, we saw obviously the kind of activities that other schools are involved with um, and we took some of their ideas, we took lots of different ideas and it gave the children a chance to see what kind of projects they could do. Everyone and anyone of any age should take up Crest because it's exciting and enjoyable. I, th I think all schools should take part in STEM activities. It also gives you the chance to interact with the children on a much more informal basis. You get to know them better, you get to find out what they're interested in and it makes them a lot more willing to take part in their normal lessons, the things that they have to do.